In this video, we're gonna show how to minimize mix span of a project uh, precedence constraint. So, if you have several machines, PM, precedence, and parallel, uh, always make sure that there is a flow shop. So, it's like uh, machine M1, M2, first and first out. And just let me add this precedence, and we're gonna do it as mix span. I'm gonna remind you, make span is uh, make span in this case is like a time when the last job would finish, and the job is flexible. It could be flexible flow shop, like we have stages, so more than one machine at every stage. So how, how let's see how to minimize the make span of a project uh, using the critical path method. I'll show it to you in a second. So we have those jobs, nine jobs, and we have this processing time for the nine jobs, and we have this precedence requirement as you see it here so uh, and uh, I'm gonna show you what I've done here so first uh, what I did I just uh, put, take a scale of all the units here from 0 to God knows how much number could be to 40 and um, the plan was like we could have as many parallel machine working together at the same time but we have to satisfy the precedence diagram so as you could see here we have machine one step one sorry and step three they're parallel step two step four they are parallel so they could be performed at the same time in a parallel manner so start with machine job one sorry again uh, so we we start with job uh, so job one it takes four it needs four steps and or four hours so it finished here at four as you could see it here it finished at four and job three is three so it finished here at three as you would see it and then we do proceed this diagram two is come after one so we do two which takes nine steps so it finished here at 13 and then we do five sorry four which take like three steps so it finished here and based on the precedence diagram we do after four there is five and five it will take six steps so it finish here at 12 we have to go back to the precedence diagram and then we have uh, five one two three and so if i gonna lose those so here if i go back so we have six eight nine Okay, so if we come back here, we do six, and six you must finish two and five in order to do six, and then we do eight here, and then nine and seven. Okay, um, uh, what I've done here, like you could see, nine it finish at uh, thirty, and so we could see like the last one to finish. So nine is a thirty and 7 it would finish at as you would see it here uh, so 7 would finish at 32 okay uh, the fact that 6 it requires 8 and we have 8 it requires 12 uh, so here it finish at 30 and 7 it finish at 32 okay uh, 7 needs 8 and so 2 it's 13 okay so if we go back here we could see that 7 you must finish 8 and 6 in order to start 7 so we must finish 8 in order to start 7 so literally here 7 would start at 24 and 7 would require 8 so this will take us to 32 okay so this is the first step if you come back to here you could see all the steps where do they finish and it's been written here and just follow it one step at a time so seven here it will finish at here at this is should be 32 okay when it finished seven because seven it must finish after eight so the next step was critical pass you consider now we know when the c max will finish like the latest job would finish at 32 after 32 hours so we start backward 
so we could say the two jobs they finished at 32 and we have to go back backward to see how it will be done so we have because we have two tracks so we consider two machines and both of them they finish at 32 uh, 9 would require 6 and 7 would require 8 and if you go back to here you see 7 and 8 must be they are follow up from step 8 so 8 cannot start till we finish 7 and 9 so it's here 8 and 6 cannot finish till we finish step 7 so we do it here okay and then we go backward the same way we've done the other one if you come here and then you write the numbers again and that same number if they are matching like we have uh, the earliest and latest possible completion time so this is three four five the earliest and latest completion time is seven eight okay so it's three four five okay eight and seven as you see so this is a critical pass method okay